Hi, this is Sean Overton with OneStepRemove.com, and in this video we're discussing getting MetaTrader alerts on your phone. Now, of course, you have to have an iPhone or you have to have an Android, which this phone runs. And you also, before you go through any of these steps, it's really important to note, if you don't have the source code changed to include the words send notification in your expert advisor or your custom indicator, this is all for naught. Otherwise, you've got to go through setting up an SMS alert, which is totally different, and you've got to use email. This is a lot more convenient, and it's also a lot simpler to do. So assuming that you've changed the source code or got the programmer to do it, then these steps make sense. So with that big caveat, I'm going to show you what I've done on my phone. Is first thing is I open MetaTrader, and I'm here on the main screen showing my main trade. And then I click over here, and I click on the Settings button. And here you'll see where it says Settings. And I clicked on messages, of course, because I tried to be suave. So I click on settings, and then if you scroll down here all the way to the bottom, which I'm not going to show you because I don't want you to use my ID and get all of my alerts, is it has a thing called the MetaQuotes ID. You're going to write down this number, save it, and then you're going to go on to the next step. Now that you've selected the MetaQuotes ID from your phone, you need to get on your desktop and you need to open up MetaTrader, which you see here on my screen click on tools options you'll want to make sure the tab at the top reads notifications and then here it's just two more steps you want to put a check next to enable push notifications and then here in this box you're going to want to type in your MetaQuotes ID again I don't want to show you my ID so you don't get all of my alerts I type it in real quick and I'm going to push test okay and from now I should be waiting for this alert to come in and now they all came in. So you see there's a 20 second delay between when I push test and when it came in. Push notifications are not good for trying to get actionable real time, I gotta do this right this second. There is a delay and it's going to depend entirely on your network carrier. I have Virgin Mobile which has been pretty good to me in the Dallas area but it's intermittent. Sometimes when I run this test it happens literally within a second and then other times it takes 20 or 30 seconds. For me, it's good. I like to use push notifications for my live trading on an expert advisor just to tell me when I've switched positions. But if I was trying to run over to the computer and place a trade right away, I don't think this is a good idea. Uh, if you have any questions on push notifications or how to add the ability to get push notifications into your EAs and custom indicators, you can find me at www.onestepremove.com. My name is Sean Overton. Thank you for listening.